In this video, we're gonna do two things. One is I'm gonna address a complaint, kind of a surprising complaint from one of my members. And two, we're gonna go over the very best baritone in the world. All right, welcome to You Collect the Pros. I'm Terry Carter. And yes, I do have my red shirt on. And you're correct. I don't even have a baritone in my hand. That's how inspired I was this morning. I woke up, get up real early, and I was like, I gotta, I gotta address this email that was forwarded to me by my team. And then I figured while addressing it, I'll read it to you in a second. I'll talk about the best baritone in the world. But you're here and I appreciate it. If you wanna have a chance to win an ukulele, we give away every single month right here on the channel. You just gotta do two things. Make sure to subscribe, turn on that bell notification while you do it, and then click the link below and go sign up. That's it. Do those two things, you're automatically entered to win that. Now, you might notice I have my Koaloha Black label. That's right, this is my personal ukulele, but this is a tenor. I don't even have a baritone. <laughs> I was like hoping that I might even have one of the brand new Kala Ukulele the Pros baritones here, but everything's at the shop. But as I mentioned, I'm so passionate that I had to just jump in front of the camera and address this email here and then talk about the very best baritone in the world. All right, so uh, are you ready for it? Because by the way, everything I'm going to talk about is all going to be at store.youcollectopros.com. Uh, but let me, uh, let me get to this, this email in just one second, all right? So I'm gonna talk about the best baritone, but let me let me go over this this. All right? And by the way, this is only one part of this whole email. All right? This is just one one thing. This is number three. It says, I wanted to buy a uke. So I researched heavily from Terry's videos. As you know, we do a lot of videos, especially on baritone, because we have a lot of baritone content over at ukeactopros.com courses and Q and A's and all that kind of stuff. Uh, the problem is every uke is the best and most exciting. He can't say anything bad about them because he's in cahoots with the companies. So we can't get an honest review. I ended up buying a uke from a different seller. All right. So it's fine. Criticism, all that kind of stuff is fine. I mean, we get that all the time. It's part of being a business. It's part of growing. It's part of becoming the biggest number one store online and lessons and stuff like that. So that happens. But I was thinking about this and I wanted to address this because I'm in cahoots. <laughs> I am in cahoots with these companies. So the, the idea is that, yes, I am in cahoots as far as I do work with these companies from Kala to Ohana to Kanalea to Kamaka to uh, Cordoba to Lanakai, right? All these companies make baritone ukulele. So I was thinking, let me address this because I don't feel like I hide anything in my videos, all right? So I want to go down a few steps of what makes the best baritone, all right? And I appreciate you being here. If you get any Thing or have any comments, make sure to leave them below. And if you like this video, make sure to share it with your friends. All right, so let's, let's just talk about this. We have to break things down into a certain way. One, price, quality, all right? So you want to pick it the best baritone out there. It's, it's a wood, it's a quality of the ukuleles, okay? Or do you want a cheaper ukulele price point-wise? And so there's a wide range of this. I feel like I'm totally honest in all my reviews, okay? I, I do say a lot, always get a solid wood uke, okay? Get a solid top one if you can, all right? And so when I say a baritone, let's say the Kala Ziracote is, oh, I'm excited about it. I don't think I've ever said it's the best baritone in the world, but what I'm really excited about is because at that price point, it's a great baritone, all right? So let's go, let's go through this. You want, the, you want the best baritone in the world? All right, should I go from the top or should I work up to the best baritone in the world? All right, let's go start from the top. The best baritone in the world is a Kanalea baritone, all right? It's a baritone that I play in all my videos I believe it's the best feeling, the best sounding, made in Hawaii, solid koa wood. They're expensive, but they're made by a great company that's been making ukuleles for 25 years, and that's the best baritone, okay? Now, I know that there's some custom builders out there, and I don't know of all the, all the custom builders. I know Divine is making great ukuleles and baritones, okay? So I'm not talking custom stuff a little different because they're the one-offs. They're usually really more expensive. I'm talking about Stuff that's really more accessible to us, right? So one, Kanalea, right? You're getting the quality there. 
I like the Kamaka baritones as well. They're a little bit bigger. They're, you know, they're not, they're, I don't like them as much as the Kanalea, right? but I do like the Kamaka baritones as well. Though Those are in a higher price point because those are made in Hawaii by two of the best companies out there in the world. And I believe that. I believe that those companies are the best. Am I in cahoots with them? I am because I'm a dealer with them. They're all my friends. I talk to them. I get to know them. We have a relationship, even a business relationship, but they're also making great instruments at the same time. All right. As we go down, there's really kind of a big gap between the Kanalea and the Kamaka. I know I don't even have a baritone, but that's okay. <laughs> um, so the next one I like is the Ponos. All right? I really like the Ponos. They have several different models. I like the Pro Classics, right? Those ones are a little bit over $1,000. Those are really nice all solid wood made in Java. Uh, you get the nice uh, gloss finish. You get the binding, but really quality. You got a bunch of different woods in those. So that's over, over a thousand. Then you drop down to the Pono line, of the Deluxe. Okay, the Deluxe line isn't quite as fancy as a Pro Classic, but again, you got a lot of different variations in the wood from mango uh, to mahogany to uh, acacia. They don't do coal wood in the Pono stuff. And then just the regular Pono uh, line, which is just their, their classic line, which is uh, just a little bit over four or 500 bucks. All right. So those, that's it. We got Kanalea, Kamaka, Pono. All right. Now when we get down to the, the $400 range and below, okay, now we're talking about Kala and Ohana. And yes, these are my favorite baritones in this price point. Okay. I really like if we take Kala, okay, for example, SSEBY-B-C. I like that baritone a lot. Solid spruce top, Acacia, I mean, sorry, striped ebony sides and back. And just by the way, this is all coming from the top of my head here. All right, it's got the cutaway. It's also got the nice Fishman pickup. I like that baritone, all right? It's about in the $400-ish range, right? a little bit more, but all right, I like that baritone in that price range. I also like to call it SAB, which is solid acacia wood, okay? Are they the best baritones in the world? I don't think they're the best baritones, but at that price point, they're solid wood ukuleles. Well, the, the SSEBY isn't all solid, but it's got the solid top, like I mentioned. The Acacia One SAB is a nice solid wood ukulele. Okay, I think they're great at that price point too, the four hundred dollar price point. Then you go over to Ohana, which I also like a lot, is the BK thirty five GCE, all solid mahogany cutaway. It also has a pickup. I also like that ukulele a lot as well. Okay, again. Do I like it better than the Kanalea? I do not. But do I like it in that price point? Absolutely. It's a fantastic baritone, right? So that's in that $400-ish range. Okay, maybe plus or minus some. Then as we move, move down, you get some other stuff. You get some of like the, the Kala, uh, both, both Kala and Ohana and Cordoba and Lanakai. They kind of have cheaper ukuleles, laminate. Okay, Kala has the, the uh, what is it? The uh, KA-B, just a straight mahogany laminate baritone. That one's cool, all right? For the price. Again, for the price, it's a great baritone, okay? And then uh, the MKB, even their lower line, McCullough line, is a cool baritone for like, I think it's even 100 bucks or under 100 bucks. But it's like, it sounds good. It plays decent for that price point, okay? And then Ohana has their their lower line, the BK10, the BK20, all right? Those are cool. Ukulele Cordoba has a few. So does Lanakai, all right? So again, where are you in price point? Do you laminate? versus solid top versus all solid versus the best of the best. So that's how I feel about this stuff. I like all the baritones that I carry. I don't carry every baritone in the world at store.youcollectopro.com. And trust me, I get a lot of companies, a lot of companies, you don't realize this, I get a lot of companies always asking me to carry their brands, okay? Oh, would you carry our ukuleles? Would you carry this? Would you carry this? I don't say yes to everything. I carry the brands that I believe in. I believe in their instruments. I believe in their as a company, and I believe in them as their customer service, their warranty issues as well, because I want you to be happy and have an instrument that you're going to be excited about. So anyway, hopefully we addressed a lot of stuff. Uh, hopefully I got this off my chest and that you understand where I'm coming from when I do reviews uh, of how I feel about instruments. And I've told you what I feel the best of the best. Kanalea, I love those baritones. Kamaka, Pono the Kala, Ohana stuff, and then the Cordoba and the Lanakai stuff. It all depends on the price point you're looking for, the kind of wood you're looking for, laminate, solid tops, uh, all solid wood. Depends on what do you want, spruce? Do you want mahogany? Do you want acacia, mango, light, coal wood? It all depends. So there's a lot of factors in it, but there's baritones in all your price points, and I think they're all great. And if I carry them, that means I think they're 
great quality instruments, and that will help you continue to build up until you get to the Kanalea Kamaka stage. So anyway, I appreciate you being here. <laughs> Hopefully you got some value. Leave some comments below. If you want to find out more about us, we have a great Patreon page. That's You Collect the Pros. We also got, as I mentioned earlier, YouCollectThePros.com, all our courses. We got a fantastic platinum membership. And then, of course, a store for all your ukulele needs. So thanks for being here. Let me, let me talk a little bit. Hopefully uh, this helped. And we'll see you next time. Thank you.